Grace Kitchens presents Creative Cooking, a season of popular favorites featuring dishes for every meal of the day. And here now is today's host. Welcome to Creative Cooking. Today we come to you from Central High School in the parish of Clarendon. With me is Mr. Vinroy Harrison, the principal of the school. Hi, Mr. Harrison. Thanks for having us at, at, at your place. Yes, ma'am. But first of all, let me welcome you to Central High School. Joining us for the program also is Kadeen Thomas, and you are a fifth form student. Yes, I am. And you're going to be preparing food for us today, right? Yes. I have a discussion with the principal before. Share with us some of the programs that are offered here at Central High School. I hear you're doing very well. Some of the vocational courses that we offer include machine shop and welding, mm -hmm. auto mechanics, carpentry and joinery, food and nutrition, clothing and textile, cosmetology, business education. Students are so trained along the vocational route mm -hmm. so that they can employ themselves after leaving school. What is the certification they gain? Well, um, actually they get a school leaving certificate. Yeah. Also, students in the vocational area, they are also exposed to the NCT VET um, certification. Now, for our students in the sixth form program, we have a number of students who perform creditably well. Um, to mention Jerome Nichols, who he was successful in 10 subjects. He got eight ones, a two, and a three. What is the involvement of the PTA? Well, the PTA is very much involved in our school, if I may say, inextricably involved. Give me an idea of numbers. Now, mm -hmm. when we call a PTA meeting, uh, we cannot house our parents. We don't have enough um, room mm -hmm. for them. It was a pleasure talking to you, Mr. Harrison. Yes, ma'am. All the best in your school programs. Thank you mm -hmm. very much. Hi, Kadeen. Before you prepare the meal for us, we need to know a little about yourself. What career plans do you have? In the future, I would like to pursue a career in home economics education. Oh, beautiful. So I suppose you'll be going on to lecture in the area of home economics yes, education. Yes, Okay, well, the sky is the limit and we are just impressing upon you the importance of working towards that goal. Okay. And what are you preparing for us today? Today I'll be preparing mini pizza sandwich. Today I'll be preparing mini pizza. First, I'm going to add diced garlic to the pot. Then, onion. After adding onion, I'll add sweet pepper. Then stir. After adding sweet peppers, add oregano. Then, tomato. And stir. I'll add grace tomato ketchup. Then I'll stir this together. We're cooking to develop flavors in the sauce. Here I have steamed callaloo and cheddar cheese. First, I'm going to put this on the bread. After that, I'll add some cheese, cheddar cheese. After adding cheddar cheese, add steamed callaloo. Then just top it with a little more cheddar cheese. Then I'll garnish this with sweet pepper. Mm -hmm. 
I'll put this in the oven to bake for three minutes. Hi, Kadeen. Hi, Miss Miller. That is a very interesting way of using up Kalalue. Tell us about the pizzas that you, you have displayed all of four pizzas there. Tell us yes. about them. Yes. This one is the Kalalue that I baked ahead mm -hmm. of time. Right. This is this one with the sardine. Okay. The sardine. One. Interesting way of using sardine, yes? That's tuna mm -hmm. and that's chicken over there. So you have actually served four different toppings. Yes. And you're saying select the one that you really like. Right. Um, this is an idea that many people in your age group would like to make, right? Yes. You like pizzas, right? Yes, I do. Okay, thank you very much. From the mailbox today comes this question. Please share with us some quick and easy pizza bases that we can use at home. Joining me for this segment of the program is Mrs. Jean Manning, the head of the Home Economics Department at Central High School in Clarendon. Hi, Mrs. Manning. Welcome Hi, to Creative Cooking. Our children have developed a love affair with pizza. Eh? Yes, they yeah. have. And you know, it is a question. They're asking for right. pizza bases. We would like okay. you to share. I see you have some here. Let us share them with our, our viewers, Mrs. Manning. Okay, pizza originated yes. with the Italians. Yes. And it came out of a need. What it was, was at the need? end of the week yes. when the ingredients were low. Yes. They gather all the scraps and Left this to... was what they came up with, the and pizza. The scraps we're talking about your leftover foods. Right. Yes. Jamaicans are very innovative. They are creative. We people. are not just sticking to the yeast bread, yeast bread again, yes. right? We have so many interesting bases here today. Over here we have the pita bread. Yes. We have whole wheat biscuits. Yes. We have the hard dough bread yes we have corn corn bread, bread yes. right and there are a host of many other, other things even lasagna oh, is sure. used as a base have you ever thought of pizza. bamis bamis yeah. um rotis Roti, all yes. of the indians take us give us roti. right we we'll usually have that with you know um curry dishes right but we are saying that roti too could be used as a as pizza, a pizza base, base. So. mrs manning it was a pleasure working with you today we really thank you for sharing in today's program and we are very happy to have you Macy. thanks for coming okay. you're welcome we hope you enjoyed today's show let us hear from you by mail by phone or by email till next time thanks for watching make it a date to tune into smile jamaica 7.35 every Monday morning with a repeat every Sunday at 2.50 p.m. That's Creative Cooking by Grace Kitchens. Don't miss it. <laughs>